my progress is, um, I don't want to say paltry, but all I managed to do is get in five hanging studs, as it were. Uh, they're only there to hide the vent for the stove, but it is possible that I will fasten cabinetry to them. So I think uh, at least in the vertical, they have to be able to carry some, some weight. So the one by three is there simply as a guide for when I <clears throat> use the circular saw to trim all of the studs to a single length um, level. That's it. Let's head upstairs. Just taking a look at the big gaps that I left. I, I'm responsible for most of the drywall up here. And so before they can mud and tape, and this was consistent, every person that bid on this job said the same thing. They would have to come in and pre-fill all of these gaps that I left. So that's what the fellas did tonight. Father and son team, very friendly fellas. Um, knowledgeable, which is wonderful. They have, uh, oh, and they even cleaned up the hatch. <clears throat> so, and they started to repair some of the god awful cuts I did in the drywall. Um, anyway, it seemed like good guys. They've got uh, the big holes filled up tonight, and they suggested that they'd be back tomorrow night with some kind of um, machine that applies the tape. So I'm really actually quite excited to see that. I, I hope uh, they'll allow me to video it so that I can share it with you. All right. Bye for now.